everyone um welcome to another episode or welcome back to my life get it okay um today uh we're gonna do a uh so i'd like to introduce you to the banana gtr and uh we're going to go wreck some people's days with it so uh yeah let's get to it So I think we're going to head to uh, Surfer's Paradise and uh, find a championship to do. And uh, just, we're just going to do that and just have some fun with this uh, Banan GTR, which uh, is possibly my favorite car in the game right now. This thing actually does really good drifts for being an all-wheel drive car, but I guess since most of the power is sent to the back, like from the factory, it kind of makes sense. Anyway, uh, we're going to uh, head up this one. Nope. Japanese steel. All right. The Japanese championship, where elegant design meets precision engineering. Uh, a few specs on the GTR. Um, the only thing I remember right now is horsepower, and I think it's close to 1,200. It might be like 57 off, but let's just say it the 1200 horsepower banana GTR it's fast it's the only it <laughs> the great the best thing about Forza is that it is the only game that makes sense to have over a thousand horsepower because there's no limits and uh, you can actually get away with it Sorry I'm not talking so much. I'm quite concentrated on uh, driving right now. As you all should be while driving in real life. Just a quick little PSA for you. Which I'm sure all of you are responsible drivers. All right. See if we win anything besides money and XP. Nope. 
Nope. That's fine. It's just fine. I didn't want to win anything anyway. Alright, on to the next event. And look at that edge right down the road. How about that? I love the uh, the uh, AI that's using the Nissan Titan. Very ambitious uh, person. Oh god, okay. Yeah, I suck, I know. Oh god, okay, but uh, yeah, all right. Oh god, but cheeks, okay. Why not drift the corner? Because why not? Look at that. I'm actually starting to get good at drifting now. Maybe I should try to do it in real life. Probably wouldn't be a good idea on a front-wheel drive uh, Honda, so... Oh, well. Maybe I should concentrate on driving first before I lose to a Honda. Which is not a bad thing. This is... I'm in a GTR. Come on. All right, let's see if we win anything this time. Doubt it, but you know, gotta be optimistic, right? Okay, I mean, I can make, I can work with it. Maybe, I don't know, we'll see. I remember in Forza Motorsport 6, the Aston V12 Zagato car, if you add a supercharger on it, it did nothing. <laughs> I, I'm not sure that was a glitch or that's like real, I doubt it's real, but it literally did nothing. It just added weight to the car. It was dumb. I was greatly confused, but whatever. All right, last race. I think. I'm pretty sure it is. I was looking online the other day at GTRs and seeing how much they were and how much like they're valued and like I see all these people buying GTRs 
like on YouTube and stuff. And I'm like, I don't blame you. They're cheap. Well, I mean, for a supercar, they're stupid cheap. And very easily obtainable by a lot of people. And I hope to be one of those people one day. Yes, I'm a GTR fanboy. Do I care? No. I love the car. It's cool. It sounds good when you straight pipe it. And honestly, that's probably the only way to do it. I think if I dig a GTR, it would be like the one I'm driving right now, but maybe not banana yellow. Maybe like black or red or some uh, crazy like uh, white, black, and gray uh, camo wrap. Oh God, okay. Clench my butt cheeks on that one. Yeah, we won, no surprise. Because that's literally all I do is win. Alright, that does it for uh, this video. Hope you had fun. But uh, yeah, if you want to see more videos like this, uh, hit the like button. Uh, let me know down in the comments what you think and what I should do better. Yeah, if you're stopping in for the first time, please uh, subscribe and uh, have a great day.